Hey there, future millionaires. Welcome to the thrilling world of the stock market, where fortunes are made and lost every day. Want to learn about the stock market? Whether you're a complete beginner or someone looking to refine your investment strategies, you've come to the right place. You're in the right place. This guide is designed to be your comprehensive resource for understanding the ins and outs of stock trading. This guide is your ticket to investing, whether you're just starting out or want to improve your game. Let's dive in. We'll cover everything from the basics of what stocks are to advanced trading techniques. The stock market can seem scary, but don't worry. It's normal to feel overwhelmed at first, but with the right knowledge and tools, you'll gain the confidence to navigate this complex world. We'll break it down into easy steps. From understanding stock market terminology to learning how to analyze market trends, we've got you covered. By the end, you'll be ready to invest like a pro. You'll learn how to create a diversified portfolio, manage risks, and make informed decisions that can lead to financial success. Get ready for an exciting journey. The stock market is not just about numbers and charts. It's about understanding the stories behind the companies and industries you invest in. So buckle up and let's get started on this exciting adventure together. Why invest? Investing grows your money. It's like planting a seed that grows into a money tree. Investing helps you reach your financial goals, like buying a house or retiring early. India has fantastic stock markets like the NSE and BSE. These markets let you buy and sell pieces of companies called stocks. When companies do well, your investments grow. It's a win-win. Ready to start? First, learn the basics. Read books, watch videos and take online courses. Knowledge is power. Then, open a demat and trading account. These are like your investing toolbox. Choose a SEBI registered broker. They are the experts who help you buy and sell stocks. Now, the fun part. Choosing your stocks. Look for companies with strong growth potential. Do your research. Fundamental analysis is like checking a company's report card. Just as a student's report card reveals their academic performance, a company's financial statements reveal its financial health and potential for growth. You look at their financials to see if they're a good investment. This involves diving deep into various documents such as balance sheets, income statements, and cash flow statements. Each of these documents provides a different perspective on the company's financial status. Key metrics are like clues. They help you piece together the overall picture of the company's performance. For instance, metrics like revenue, profit margins, and return on equity can give you insights into how efficiently the company is being run. Revenue and profit growth show if the company is making money. Consistent growth in these areas is a positive sign, indicating that the company is expanding and increasing its market share. It's like watching a plant grow. Steady and healthy growth is a good indicator of future potential. Earnings per share, or EPS, tell you how much profit each share earns. This metric is crucial because it helps investors understand the profitability of the company on a per share basis making it easier to compare with other companies. The P.E. ratio compares the stock price to earnings. A lower P.E. ratio might indicate that the stock is undervalued, while a higher P.E. ratio could suggest that the stock is overvalued. This ratio helps investors gauge the market's expectations of a company's future earnings. Debt to equity ratio shows how much debt the company has. A high ratio could be a red flag, indicating that the company is heavily reliant on debt to finance its operations. Conversely, a lower ratio suggests a more stable financial structure. Understanding this balance is crucial for assessing the risk associated with investing in the company. Beyond these metrics, it's also important to read the company's annual report. This document provides a comprehensive overview of the company's operations, strategies and future outlook. It's like getting a behind-the-scenes look at the company's plans and how they intend to achieve their goals. Comparing the company with its peers in the same industry can also provide valuable insights. This helps you understand how the company stands relative to its competitors and whether it has a competitive edge. 
consulting with financial advisors or using investment tools can further enhance your analysis. These resources can provide additional perspectives and help you make more informed investment decisions. Ultimately, fundamental analysis equips you with the knowledge to make better investment choices. By understanding the financial health and potential of a company, you can invest with greater confidence and increase your chances of achieving your financial goals. Section 5. Mastering the Art of Technical Analysis Technical analysis is like reading the stock market's mind. It involves studying past market data, primarily price and volume, to forecast future price movements. By analyzing historical data, traders can identify patterns and trends that may repeat in the future. You use charts and indicators to predict future price movements. These charts can include various types of data visualizations, such as line charts, bar charts, and candlestick charts, each providing unique insights into market behavior. It's like being a stock detective. You gather clues from the market's past behavior to make educated guesses about its future. This detective work involves recognizing patterns like head and shoulders, double tops and bottoms, and triangles. Moving averages smooth out price fluctuations. They help traders identify the direction of the trend by averaging the price data over a specific period. For example, a 50-day moving average can show the medium-term trend, while a 200-day moving average can indicate the long-term trend. The Relative Strength Index, or RSI, measures momentum. It ranges from 0 to 100 and helps identify overbought or oversold conditions in the market. Bollinger Bands show volatility by plotting two standard deviations away from a simple moving average. When the bands widen, it indicates higher volatility. When they narrow, it suggests lower volatility. Support and resistance levels are like price floors and ceilings. Support is a price level where a stock tends to find buying interest, preventing it from falling further. Resistance is a price level where selling interest is strong enough to prevent the price from rising further. These tools help you make smart trading decisions. By combining various indicators and chart patterns, traders can develop a comprehensive strategy to maximize their chances of success. Remember, technical analysis is not foolproof but it provides a structured approach to understanding market dynamics and making informed decisions. Section 6. Building your stock market dream team. Don't put all your eggs in one basket. Diversify your portfolio by investing in different sectors. It's like having a team of all-star stocks. Invest in technology, healthcare, finance and consumer goods. This spreads your risk. If one sector goes down, others can cushion the fall. A balanced portfolio is a winning portfolio. Section 7. Staying ahead of the game. Monitoring your investments. Investing is a marathon, not a sprint. Monitor your investments regularly. Keep track of market news and company announcements. Stay informed. Read quarterly reports to see how your companies are performing. Are they meeting their targets? Adjust your portfolio as needed. Stay flexible and adapt to market changes. Section 8. Your journey to financial freedom starts now. Congratulations, you're now a stock market whiz. Remember, investing is exciting and rewarding. Be patient, be consistent and watch your money grow. The stock market offers incredible opportunities. Start small. Learn as you go and never stop investing in yourself and your future. Happy investing!